thing that was important. And I said, before you get to the gate, Jesus has touched you. Before you go to the gate, he ran back shouting. Jesus, he said, before you get back to your home, that your desire turn around is delivered for a testimony. Lift up your two hands to heaven. Let God know how grateful you are that he brought you to 2020. Let God know how grateful you are that you made it to 2020 in spite of the wishes of the wicked. He brought you into 2020. Would you give him thanks for it? Would you celebrate him for it? Lift him up. Lift him up. Lift him up. Thank you, Jesus, for bringing me to 2020 in spite of the wickedness of the wicked. Thank you for keeping me alive and well up till this moment. Thank you for the agenda you have unveiled to me concerning 2020. Thank you for my portion of that global agenda. Thank you because I'm not missing that for anything. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Father. In Jesus' precious name, men and brethren, members of this household of faith, when I pray, God hears because He sent me. Everything declared on your life today becomes a reality in your life. No one under the sound of my voice worldwide and those who will pick it from the various platforms we know failure again. <laughs> from today you will not know any more setback. Nothing dies in your hand. It is not unspiritual to be challenged, but it's unscriptural to be defeated. You will never know defeat anymore in your life. Whatever anyone may have lost in the course of the battles of life, I decree your double restoration this quarter. In the name of Jesus Christ. The same way this commission keeps killing new heights time and again, you never know stagnation anymore. You never know stagnation anymore. And in the name of Jesus, the year 2020 shall be a year of testimonies for you all through. It shall be a year of testimonies for you all through. Grace not to look back like Lord's wife. Grace to keep pushing and keep running after God after God, all the days of your life, receive it right now. He says, whoever puts his hand upon the plow and looks back is not fit for the kingdom of God. Luke 662. Luke 962. Now, in the name of Jesus, you will remain fit for the kingdom all the days of your life. Well, Exactly what happened in the year of release of Joseph will happen to you this year. <laughs> it was a multi-level change that Joseph enjoyed. Multi-level change. There are those standing here today where you will find yourself by the second quarter of this year, you'll be crying for joy. <laughs> Many will appear at Shiloh 2020 a hundred times where they are. God is able to multiply us a thousand times many more. 
there are people here today that will appear at Shiloh 2020 a thousand times where they are now. It took us about three years to complete the building in the old church. And that is 3,000 capacity because we're using the place and all that. But he did this one in one year. And without a budget, my God will surprise you. Without begging or borrowing, my God will surprise you. He built Covenant University, the first phase, in seven months. 1,500 students resumed. Now, the greatest project of your life from this time onward will be stress free. Will be stress free. Now, no one under the sound of my voice will ever bury their children. You will not know the graveyard of your grandchildren. And you yourself, you will enjoy a good old age. In strength, in honor, in prosperity, adding value all the way, in the name of Jesus. So shall it be. So shall it be. And so shall it be. The year 2020 will answer to you to the letters. You shall be breaking limits in all directions. You shall be breaking limits in all directions. You shall be breaking limits in all directions. In the name of Jesus. Everything works here. Beginning from now. And that's not strange. All things work together for good. From this time on, with a genuine heart for God, everything will keep working together for your good. Therefore, in the name of God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, welcome to 2020, your year of breaking limits. 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 Lift up those two hands, everybody, and give God thanks. In Jesus' precious name, we are praying. Well, you have given him thanks. You'll be thankful.